so now we're moving on to dessert. So we're gonna make something called banana boats. Basically, it's going to be a really good dessert of bananas, chocolate, peanut butter, and marshmallows. So the first thing you wanna do is you wanna cut your banana right along the skin. So just kind of slowly make an incision along your banana. And you are going to want to leave the skin on for this because the skin is basically going to be our vessel for our banana. It's the boat for our banana boats. And these are just mini chocolate chips. I'm going to stuff them in the sides of our banana skin. So just tuck those in around the banana up into the skin. Make sure that you get them all along the sides of the banana. If you like peanut butter, I know it's not for everybody. Um, it goes really well with chocolate. And I think it is really good in banana boats. So you can just do a smear down the middle if you want to do it that way. Or you can line the sides kind of like I did with the chocolate chips. And then the peanut butter will also kind of create a vessel for your last component to stick to the banana. And that is going to be our mini marshmallows. I guess you could pre-cook these if you wanted to, do roasted mini marshmallows, but they are going to get kind of hot in the fire anyway. So the idea is that they will roast themselves, hopefully. And just stick those to the peanut butter, that way that they'll stay in there a little bit better. And then once you have done that, you can add as much as you want. You do want to make sure that you still have the skin on those, so don't stuff it too much, otherwise it'll break. I'm going to add a little bit more chocolate on the top. I'm going to stuff that in there. And then all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wrap my banana in the aluminum foil, and then I'm gonna stick it onto the fire. So tuck it in nicely, and then I'll just place it along the top of the fire. You don't really wanna roast it because you're not really trying to burn it or cook it in any way, you're basically just trying to get it warm enough to where it melts all the components inside of it. Oh, yeah, that's all you want to see. So now you have a nice melty marshmallow chocolate peanut butter combination. And then ideally, you eat this with a fork. Do we have a fork? No. <laughs> we don't have a fork. <laughs> You could eat it with your hands, but it's going to be messy. We have a knife. You could eat it with your knife. Basically, you just want to cut a little bit of banana, get some of that chocolate and marshmallow. It's good. <laughs> it's pretty good. It's going to be really messy. Don't forget a fork. <laughs> Don't forget a fork. Don't be like us.